Hello, and welcome to another meeting of the Lotus Council. So what do we have today? We got a little bit of time spiral. So, came damaged. I didn't want to keep it sealed. Plus, I figured it might be good to look at this one last time before going. And I needed a few packs. for the Chaos Commander that I build with my kids each year. So I'm going to get a few packs out of here. Keep getting all the sliver ones for some reason. There we go. Yeah, we'll do that. So three packs each, and you'll see those here in a minute. All right. So this was the first of those remastered sets. Pretty good set. We got a Tomb Stalker and a Past in Flames with a Night Token. So I'm just going to kind of pull... Yeah, I'll just kind of leave these in a file. We'll just pull out the rares and those because kind of what we're looking for. So... Ooh, Lightning Axe is very playable. So we got a Reiterate and a Stone Horn Dignitary. This was a really, really, really big hit of a set. I absolutely loved it. Um, some issues with getting it if you bought it online. So we got Mirai the Cursed, Ethereal Armor, and a Grape Shot Foil. Where if you bought from Amazon, you were likely to get a repack box because of the way Amazon hang handles packs. Another grape shot. So, kind of a huge problem. So, we got Porphyry Nodes, Master of the Pearl Trident, and a Soldier Token. That's cool. I'm building Merfolk, so that can go in with my Merfolk. Yeah, I know. Merfolk's not that great. I don't care. I play for fun. Okay, Singer Nosferatu. Relentless Rats, and a Grave Scrambler with a Spider Token. And very soon there will be Dominaria Remastered. Basically like this set, just with, rather than a block, it's from a whole bunch of, ooh, First Mythic, Ancestral Vision, Hedron Archive, and a Goblin. It's from all the sets based on Dominaria. Through Magic's history, of course, they're not going to do anything that is reserve list. Yada, yada, yada. We got Thelon of Havenwood and Secret Plans with the Soldier Token. So, yeah, because the box was damaged and I don't want to keep this in my sealed. really wanted to open it, so. Okay, we got a Stuffy Doll, Ramen Up Ruins, a Maru Scout, and a Cloud Spirit Token. So I'm kind of going through this fast. I'm kind of excited for the Dominary Remastered. I think that's going to be another hit based off of the cards that they have in there, though who knows what will happen with Consumer Confidence because people are kind of tired of having stuff shoved down our throat. So, Glittering Wish, Liliana's Triumph, and a Sapperling. I'm really hoping for a Chalice of the Void. That would be a great hard to get. Okay. Angel's Grace, Mortify, which is playable, and Poultice Sliver with Llanowar Elves. Because there's a card that makes Llanowar Elves in here. Alright. Ooh, that Brute Force got brutalized. And of course, Simeon Spirit Guide used to be worth, you know, a couple bucks. Well, it got banned in Modern. So we got a Coalition Relic and a Thradagusk with an 8 token. So one mythic so far, about halfway through what we're opening of the box. And you'll have to watch another video for the rest. So Care Keep, Dreadheart Arcanist, and Erratic Mutation with a Goblin token. Okay. Sudden Spoiling. And a Lava Spike. 
Okay, that's a that's a good one. And assembly worker. I like lava spike. I don't know what formats it's legal in though. Ooh, that's a good mythic. So Gauntlet of Power. This one getting reprinted. We got an epic experiment and then Angel of Salvation foil. So we'll put that with the rares. I mean, it's going to go down in price because I think they just reprinted that in the new Dominaria. So we got a Dryad Arbor, which I will put over here because I need to pull it out. Sorcerer's Spyglass and a Metallic Sliver. That should complete my play set of those for modern play. All right. Ooh, we got a Sliver Legion and Alicia, who smiles at death. So three Mythics. It's okay, but Sliver Legion used to be a very, very expensive card until this set. Actually, a lot of these were expensive. So we got a Draw New Lich Lord, Bedlam Reveler, and Sitinul Wood Readers with Lana War Elves. But then with the reprints, prices went down, people could play. So it's a good thing. All right. I love small. We got a Fungus Sliver and a Path to Exile with a Goblin. So, we'll just keep going and see what we get. Okay, we got Mages of the Future and Field of Ruin with a Griffin Token. So we haven't seen the Foil alternative. Oh, ho, ho. Yeah, this is definitely not a repack, <laughs> despite big damage. Okay, we got an Urborg, a Dovin's Veto, and a Drowned Witch Lord. I'm going to put the Urborg over here because it's like a $35 land right now. Despite getting reprinted, it's gone back up. Some of these did shoot back up in price after the reprint, so. Ah, it's such a good... Such a good card. You always need more of that one. It's good trade fodder. So we got an If High Arcanist and a Pan Harmonicon. So we'll just kind of do that because these been a little bit long. So we got a few more packs left. I have to look and see how many packs come in those Dominaria uh, remastered. We got Sarah Avenger. Okay. So you have to wait to turn four, but it's a great one. And old school ancient stirrings, which I love the the way they, they made that look. Really, really cool card. Not really expensive, but fun. Okay, so we got oh, we got ourselves a Tarmogoyf. Oh my goodness! So we're doing pretty decent with the spicy stuff, young peasy. I remember when Tarmogoyf was like 100 bucks, almost. It was quite the card. That's about 10, 15. Oh, ho, ho, ho. we got a Joy of the Get To and a Leyline of the Void. I keep pulling Leylines of the Voids whenever I open these packs. It's okay because it's a great card that's played a lot. It's 12, 15 bucks, so. Decent amount. Ooh, Mages of the Moon. This is a great one. And then Trinket Mage with a spider token. Look how creepy that spider is. Hmm. It's good stuff all around. Oh. Okay, so we got a Venser. We got Felden of the Third Path. And Anger of the Gods is our, our foil of these. <laughs> wow, well, that's a real kick in the pants. That's got the art from yeah okay okay so we got a boom bust and a primeval titan which i love primeval titan why couldn't you be foil and then we got a minions murmurs with an insect token so we got one two three four true mythics and then some pretty decent rares and extent and these uh, shifted rares, and we did get uh, time shifted foil anger of the gods. Not ideal, but it is what it is. 
And I mean, we did get a few other good things like Panarchnikon, Dovin's Veto, Path to Exile, Lava Spike, maybe, Arcanist. I'll play this, Ramming Up Ruins. Hedron Archive, I'll definitely play. Uh, Relentless Rats, yeah. That one's a decent one. Ethereal Armor is fun. That one is a really fun one, so. And then I think the rares were all pretty standard for this. Most of them have gone down. Um, Sarah Avenger might be a bit more than a, than a buck, but I don't know. Coalition Relic. Maybe Stuffy Doll, I think, is going back up. Reiterate, I think, is a little bit, but yeah. So really, it's all in our mythics here. So Anyway, we want to thank you for joining us today. If you're on the lookout for cards, go check out our friends over at Geekified. You can find them at geekifiediowa.com. And if you want to know when we're doing our next video, go ahead and subscribe, hit that bell notification, and join us in our Discord. Which you should do, because we do fun stuff in the Discord. So, with that, that's all we have for today. And our meeting is now adjourned, but we hope you have an absolutely fantastic day.